Hey girls, it's Thursday. Just barely, but it is. And apparently we're making videos this week and apparently they're classy. Um, so yeah, sorry I'm filming a late night video. I decided to class it up with an armchair because, you know, that's really the only thing that late night indoor lighting is good for, is looking classy by a fireplace. So, from the videos thus far, I've deduced that the theme this week is the Olympics. Excuse me if the lighting is terrible. By the way, hopefully it's sexy. Um, the only thing that I have to say about the Olympics is that Miranda came home! And look, I have this poster of her face, and she signed it. And I'm gonna put it up on my wall at my dorm, next to my Hunger Games poster. See what I did there? And I'm gonna brag about my cool friend who, you know, is going to school soon. So, we're barely gonna see her, but it was really good to see her. I haven't seen her in like a year, but it was probably the most fun Olympics I've ever seen, being able to watch Miranda compete. Uh, because unlike you, Natalie, I wasn't exactly devastated when the Olympics were over. I would watch them at night you know, whatever was showing, basically it was always running or swimming or gymnastics, just the popular sports, even though I would much prefer to watch, like, trampolining and table tennis. But yeah, so I'm not super devastated that they're over, but that was definitely the most exciting Olympics that I've ever watched, because I cared more than in the past. It was really fun watching Miranda, and I can't wait until Rio. I think that'll be really fun. Uh, speaking of other awesome things in the awesome news, did you notice my shirt? I mean, I know it's been like a week since it happened, but we landed Curiosity on Mars! Success for science and America and stuff. It's really exciting. I have a nerdy story to tell you girls. So, and some of you have already told this. Um, uh, a couple of years ago, I was just wandering around on the NASA website, and I wandered upon this page, which is, like, presumably for small children, or, like, classrooms, or, you know, little kids that they want to get interested in the sciences, and they had this little program where you could send your name to Mars on the Curiosity rover on, like, this microchip thing, um, and it's pretty clear where this is going. Guys, I sent my name to Mars. <laughs> And I got a certificate. I printed off this certificate about how I sent my name to Mars because, side note, one of my life goals is to have a collection of absurd and pointless certificates. I'm the coolest kid ever. And, you know, I just really, my name is on Mars. On Mars. That's cool. And if you do that, like, degrees of separation thing, I mean, you guys know me and my name's on Mars. So you're like, one degree of separation away from Mars. That's cool. That's really cool. Mars. Mars and America and athletics and corn. Things that are awesome. And us making videos and Natalie making a video. That was great. Um, Marie, I hope to see you tomorrow so you can keep this awesome trend rolling into the new school year. But I'm definitely started to kick this up again now that summer is over. I love you girls. DFTBA. And Maria, I will see you tomorrow.